Good morning, all my viewers and subscribers. Big up on yourself, bless up on yourself. I hope you're having a lovely morning today, Wednesday. Yes, so I say 2021. Yesterday, me and my artist brethren go by the name Shakin Murray. I will a reasoning, yeah, man, a WhatsApp reasoning. And we are talking about life and a whole heap of other things. And we're getting at the Bible and we are trying to figure out where the trickery and the confusion come from. Yes, my people. So with his permission, him say me can share it with only, you know, yes, my viewers and my subscribers and you know what I say? So, my people, I want to take it in. You see me? Take in the WhatsApp reason with me and my artist virgin, Shakin Murray. Yeah, man. So, like up the video, man, and leave a comment in the comment section. You see what I say? Yeah, man, your honest opinion. Yes, man. And if you never subscribe please subscribe now man yeah man so kick it and take it away with i and i and shakin mori one love and have a blessed day right after this boy, a alpha that a boy little enough <laughs> river flood and rain a fall rain a fall but dirty tough but remember, you know, great minds discuss ideas, you know, average minds discuss events, and small minds discuss people. One day I talk to my sister, you know, because she's a big Christian, you know. You know what I mean? She's a big Christian, but life hard for her, I don't like, wow, and she's still a guy at church to get the pastor collection, you know. I may tell me, I may tell her, I say, right, and I may tell her, I say, oh, them in a church, I tell her about God, talk to them, and God tell them this, and God tell them that, you know, okay. D. God is energy, and energy manifests life. And them come up with all these nonsense and put it in a book about God, talk to them, and God this, and God that, you know. Spirituality come through energy, you know. It's just part of energy, you know. You don't need the Bible for your spirituality, you know. But my ancestors them are carried from way before the Bible, you know. And these people come and trick up people, head, you know. May I tell them, say, hell and heaven is not a place in a Rasta. Heaven and, heaven and hell is a living, you know. You ever hear a man cry out and say, boy, my life is like a living hell. And then you hear a next man with money say, boy, the way me I live right now is like me in a heaven. I saw it going in a Rasta. Heaven and hell is not a place, it's a living the higher society have the poorer, the lower society. Live in hell while them live in heaven. I saw the thing set, man. And then them tell us that this is the word of God and I saw God say. The devil is not something that come in a man, you know. A man become the devil, you know. Higher society where beat people down, you know. And a, and a slave people, you know, because we are slave, you know. You see what I say? Them become master instead of leader, you know, of we. As them servant, you know. You see what I mean, I say? And then I want it better for we, you know. They want to scrape everything and give us the scrap, you know. And them are the devil, you know. They write about themselves, you know. Yeah, man, and them are the devil, man. They write about themselves. And it trickle down. Because even sometimes we want black brother turn the devil to pan we, you know. And want murder, you know. All when we have love for them, then still want to kill we, you know. So we become angel and we become devil, man. Once you have love in your heart, you see what I mean, I say? And peace against your black brother and unity. You want to see a man strive. Just like how you want to see yourself strive. You automatically are angel. You see me? And I see once you have wicked thoughts in your mind and in your heart against your, against your people. You automatically become devil. There's no other devil out there. And you become devil and you become angel. And I tell. It's a mind manipulation. Mind control. Mental slavery. And then put fear in you in a rasta. If you tell us if you say certain things, you go and blaspheme in a rasta. You see what I mean? Say? If you say certain things, you go and blaspheme and you go and go to hell and you go and burn in a hellfire, you know. And that are the fear, you know. Them are tell us you never question the thing, you know. Them are wicked in a rasta. Them are wicked. We have to let go after the illusion in a rasta and see the thing as it is, you know. It's not an illusion thing around here, you know. A real thing, you know. My people have to do one thing first before them can even come to themselves. 
First, them have to give up the white man religion, the white man Bible, and the white man God. Because the white man God now go save them from extinction. The white man God can't save them from white man oppression. And we have to also give up the white man land and go back to Africa. We have to unite and go back, go claim our land because that is our power. We have to go, go back and claim our land king because that is our power. We have to leave for them, give them and go claim back for we want and kick them out of it too. We don't need fear your ask for no reparation. Leave the gold where them take, leave the diamond because Mama Africa still have enough for all of us. For all of us. So leave them with what them have. And we don't need to worry about some of us get up and talk about how oh, America wasn't for them. They take it from the white, they take it from the Indian man. Let the Indian man worry about that. Let the Indian man fight him one back up. Some of us gonna say Jamaica no feed them, then fight and take where they can kill off the Indian and Jamaica no feed them. Let the Indian man fight their own battle. And no feel we either. We need to find back what is how we want rightfully. Mama Africa. At this all we need to focus for going okay. But the first thing we have to do is let go of them confusion. And them Bible, their God and their religion is the confusion. We have to let go of the confusion first. We have to let go of the confusion. Because if, if we don't let go of them, can, uh, of them confusion, it not going to work. We have to let go of them Bible, of them blood clad God, and of them religion. For it to work. Go back. Let's go back to our own way of giving thanks and praising. And let go of them completely. Let's go back to Mama Africa. All of us to unite and go back to Mama Africa. Go claim our power. It is still there. It is still there, my brother. Enough is still there for us. It's better for us to go and slave on our own land than slave in the white man land king. Yes, my king. We need leaders. We need some good leader. Not ruler. Ruler, rule, and conquer, and slave the people. Leaders work with the people for a better life, a better future. Yeah, man, we need to save our race, man. Because if we don't do it, then we destroy us. That's the aim to destroy us. That's the aim to destroy us. We have a Lego half of them religion, Lego half of them Bible, and Lego half of them God. And go back to how we had it before. Yes, my lion. Them a vampire man. A them are the vampire man. Them a suck out the blood and we don't even see it. You know, some more of us live out of Jamaica than we live in a Jamaica. And it's only a pinch that leave Jamaica go to Africa. Some of us there are Europe, some they're Canada, some they are blood clot America, some they are Australia. We are all over the place, but we don't go back to Africa. We even there are China and Japan, in the Philippines. Everywhere else we are go, but we now go back to the mama land. Because of confusion with them fucking Bible and God and their religion. We need to throw away them confusion. Open up our eyes and unite and go take back our power. Because without it, we don't have nothing. And Mama Africa still have enough for every black man to survive. Exactly. The creator. You hear what you say again, Ras? You say omnipresent. Omnipresent. It is here, there, and everywhere. Energy, man, is everywhere, man. Our energy we should have been down for we need and give thanks for now. Our energy manifests life, Rasta. Energy manifests life. A energy we forgive our respect to. Energy manifests life and that my ancestors used to do. That's why they used to have the sun god. Them used to give praises unto energy. And we dash with all of that for them Bible and then religion and for them God. My ancestors realized that energy was the power behind everything. 
And that's why they used to talk about raw praises of the sun. Yeah. Because they realized that the, the energy, the energy of the sun is. Oh, my brother, I and I are trying to see every road when it comes to the level of schooling and, you know, education and all these things. We have that in common, my brother. You know, see, and like I said, the divine spirit that I guide I and I, brethren. You know, see, that I guide I and I. Yes, I. So we are set. You know, a forward, my brother. Forward. And adapt me and tell the people them from what you know. I say, people, you don't need to start listening to yourself, you know. You don't need to start listening to yourself and stop listening to people we are indoctrinated to know. And through indoctrination and the bag of garbage you are full up in, 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 in them head. When them spirit, when the divine spirit are speak through them, they are confused themselves. And now I listen to the voice there. We are speak through them as a divine spirit. Because them are, they, they, they are get confused with the indoctrination. You know, see it. But I tell them, listen to yourself. There's something about yourself where you don't know about where the oppressors them know what is great. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Uh, they might confuse themselves. They now nah, listen to themselves because the thing about it, you know, they might use another man's brain because then does I go after one book and I follow where the book is. And them now nah, met say, is a man write a book there, you know, and he use him brain to write a book there. Think. The divine does not talk through that brain where you have. And every man have to write them own story. Every Every man have to write them own story because every man was born with a brain and at that the people them miss out upon them stop listening to themselves and start listening to other people stories like the bible are the greatest story has ever told the bible story the greatest story has ever told that's it yeah man the book of confusion you know them not like when i call them books you know but that's straight so the book of confusion exactly my brother correct you see where me I deal with clear like crystal, full of clarity, brother. Yes, the confusion and not listening to yourself. And I know it's so another man's story. You don't see it? Yeah. Because I know a man just going to film cranium and that, and that I come to him. And he just plot it up and just write it up and, you know, yeah. And, and, and some people are saying, yeah, this goes on, that goes on. And that goes on, that goes on. Me and you, me and the I, me can say to the I, say, yo, could we write a Bible now? And you say, yes, shocking, we have a write a Bible. And me and the I link up. And we say, well, we have a write about now. And we just write one bag of stories, say this and that, yeah. Not never say no. We just fabricate a story. All right, yeah, this and that, it happened at such and such a time, and re, 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 re. But sometimes people are read the story properly, they might realize, say, but nothing can go like what the money has said, because this no match up with that, and that no match up with that, what they must say. You see what I deal with my brother? It's just a story, me and you fabricate up. You know, see it? But listening to yourself. The divine spirit where I speak to you is a highly thing where the people them I ignore and I get confused with. Yes, my brother. Yeah, man, you overstand straight, straight, straight up to the maximum. You know, see it? Well, I love that reason here. Yeah. You know, tell a man, I love that reason here, yeah. brother. Basically, then just give you them story. And tell you put it in your pipe, pipe and smoke it and get higher fight. Mm. Yeah man, basically at that them doing a rasta. Give you them story and tell you if you put it in your pipe and smoke it and get higher fight. Yeah man, and you take the freaking high and turn full with it. 
you can't think for yourself no more. You're too high off a of them story. <laughs> you smoke too much of it. <laughs> it's either them get high or them get drunk off of the oppressor story. So now them can't use them one brain. Them too drunk or them too high to think for themselves, my brother. Yeah, man, a real thing, man. Real thing. My brother. Yeah, man. And that's why the people then knock out, man. Then drunk. Then drunk of that story there. You don't see it. Them drunk of it. Drunk, drunk, drunk and a stagger like taunted was. And you see enough of them man they were right some of them story them, my brother. I saw I, I was some insecure men, you know. We write them, we write them sitting there, you know. You know, see it. Right, some of them sitting there, some years, some thousands of years ago, you know, and some hundreds of years ago, you know, some insecure men. Right, some of them sitting there, you know. You know, see it, and people hang on, pan it, and I fight over it, too, you know. You know what people did over there sitting there? With only, it's only for insecure men. Right. Hey, sometimes you preach some things in the Bible, man. You have to say to yourself, say, how about this, man? When you read all about, I you trying to them, man? I know what? I some of them, man, they were doing that, and then they junk him off and, and sex him off and like me. I say, how about, how about this? <laughs> but just, you know, have some things in the Bible where you, where, you, where, you, where you read and, you know, you can hold the vibes off of you. But some things in that book, the general way, I'll tell you, say, you, can have, you can have sex with a little pit in your hand. Eh? I'll tell you, man. What do you mean? I'll tell you, I'll reason about Psalms 91. And when you reach down to the end, I'll say, brother, I don't understand the part of the Psalms, you know. From my youth, I'll read the Psalms there. Like, anytime I reach a part, my body feel funny. My ears feel awake, and i say, no, it sounds confusing. You know, see it? Yeah, definitely. You know, see it, but because the name Bible and them say, you know, for question God words them and they say, you have got born up in a hell if you sin down in one place near hell and one man down there with a three teeth for a jam you jam up and you have got born up in a fire for eternity. And they say, God also have got born up too and punish you forever and all these things. And if you're sinner, and you're dead, when God come, I'm going to wake you up back and burn you up and all these things. So because of these things, how many people afraid for Christian the Bible and, and, and now see the error them in the night and, and, and tackle it and say, no man, something not right. So how a big man like me, if you go have sex with one little girl. Hmm? And the Bible, I tell you, say you can't do that. I don't get that part there. I don't get that part. No, sir. I want to hear me talk about Moses. I asked me if Moses write Genesis. He said yes. I said they know Moses write Genesis and I speak of himself as the second person. In, there's no way in Genesis it said, Hi Moses. It said, And Moses went up into the mountain and he. Then I said, How oh, 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 can a man write about himself? And, and I write about himself as he and Moses went up into the mountain and all these things. You have to know, man, something right there, sir. He written in a Genesis where Moses buried. And when him dead. Then Moses write when him dead and bury. It also when him dead and bury. How can you write when you dead? And where you bury? Me a reason with the about us with it about with a sister and a brother. What I'm saying, brother, you know, not thinking, you know, don't worry about, you not thinking. How can a man write about himself when him dead and where him bury? Something not right there, sir. I don't want them to say Moses write that. Hmm? About himself. <clears throat> Like seriously. No one man. After him saved the people them in the ark. 
The man go in and cave, in the cave. And him big daughter go in there, you know. And he look like the man never have no clothes or something because he's well junk, you know. And the big daughter sit down, sit down on it and ride it and get pregnant, you know. And come back out and tell the blood clot, younger daughter, you know, that her younger sister, you know, say, you know, daddy in there, you know. And he's junk, you know. You know. You better go get your baby from him, you know. <laughs> I really so insecure. <laughs> Pervert. Yeah, man. I, I believe that David, them, he send, David, he sent out him man, them, you know. In our town, go kill out the man, them, down there. The man, them, go. My brother, like, big, big time. Because, dear man, no one, man. Torahted, brother. In that, are they sexy, man, after ask, lot and get all pregnant. Now this thing that we are talking about David is a good one so now we we'll kill half people and take a little virgin them for themselves. I wonder if it's that part of the scripture led a lot of people astray when them go, went to war and uh, invaded other people's country. Because uh, the same thing happened in, uh, in front of us until this day. See? What we see? When America and England and even some country in Africa, when they invade them one of the tribe or, or tribal war or village war or whatever, what them do? They run in, them kill, and they rape. Rape off a little picnic of them and the woman them and rape off everything. And when them get that that, that mentality there from. No more in the Bible they read it. You know see it? When a soldier then go war, in a few time you know where we are live, where we know about. See? And that then do you know? Kill and rape off people, rape off a little bit of them and all these things. You know see it? And at that they used to do back then. No God not tell them to do nothing. No God tell them to go rape off a little bit. No God not tell them to do nothing. The only God we could have tell them to do that is man priority. We see themselves as God. Lie them I tell. You know see, come in and know which part in my life me could have a lady don't like a picnic, but me have sex with the picnic. Nonsense. Yeah, uh, people out of Africa would have said idiot. Foolish man. Nonsense. But the Bible inspired them to get that mental. The Bible gives them that, that, that mentality, the man. And them fucking soldiers, you go kill half people and rape half a little bit of them. Rape half the woman, them and the young one, them. How the Bible give them the mentality, the man. Yeah, man. The biggest book of confusion, man. The greatest story I've ever told. So, Rasta, let's go and think up for your name, you know. I'm going to run out some work, you know. I'll chat a little more. I'll tell us the reason, yeah. On a different heights, yeah, man. Blessed love king. That <laughs> have some woman so they not have sex until them blows and skirt married, you know, because it's against the Bible, you know, king. And then the motor road I walk and a car just lick down them bumble cloth and kill them, and them already 25, you know, never fuck, you know, never even have a youth, you know, and dead, you know, because the, the Bible tell them so they never blood clad fuck until them, them get. Married and baptized. <laughs> totally madness, see, brother. How much wife then says Salaman they have? No, no, hundreds of wife and hundreds of concubines. So, so um, Salaman did marry to all of them and put a ring on her finger and all these things. Eh? So, why a woman have to wait till, till them, them so called married to get pregnant? Damn foolishness, foolishness, nonsense. One thing we can't tell where we go when we die. That a one thing we can't tell. Don't question it. You would be passing the the, the, the boundary to be questioning that. You know what I say? Remember, you know, life not come in a way, no. We come in a life. So we have to leave back out of life. Life continues. You see what I say? It's like a space raster. You can put a horse in the space. You can take out the horse 
and you can put a shop. You can take out the shop, a shop where you still cannot move the space. The space remain. You can take out the shop, you can put a church. And you can break down by the church and put a warehouse. The space still remain the space. You cannot move the space. It's like life. You can't take life go nowhere. Life remain life. Energy can dead. You see what I say? It not coming and we we coming at it. And that's why we have to come back out of it because we not we not stay at it forever. We have kids and our kids enjoy it too. And them have kids and uh, so it go down. One day your time come where you come in, and one and one day your time come where you come out. I just saw the thing set. Either you come out in time or you come out untimely. I just saw the thing set. All sorts of milk. I don't know which part else I want to go to drink milk. Eh? Which part I want to go to drink milk when all the milk there. All of the bees then there. So which part which part I want to go for, oh, for honey? Eh? Where I want to run left this honey for? No, I want to enjoy the honey man. I don't know what happened when I dead man. I don't know what happened when I gone left life. Because life continues. That's what I know. Life continues because I see a whole heap of people dead and I see me still alive. Life still there. That story about milk and honey, the milk and the honey is to sweeten them story. Yeah, they use the milk and the honey and sweeten them story to make them story a little bit sweeter to catch the people, them a little bit more lovelier. With them drunk yourself. Them are evil, them are the devil, man. Yeah, man, the man who write them story, they are the devil. I him play the devil, I him a Satan, man. That thing, that thing. I even do a I metro jella, metro jella over the that man there in I long is live and I buy a brother. I think a thousand years or something like that. I'm living a metro jella. Yeah, man, I remember how much hundred years I'm live for. I think a thousand years or over a thousand years. You know, see, but the thing is, you know, <laughs> both is right, Genesis, they know he can't tell how long he live. Why we are telling why? Where are you, my brother? That thing. Yeah. Cause they realize the, the, the energy, the energy of the sun, it was it what give life to food. Is what it what give life to food. It what grow things. And we dash with all of that. We dash with all of that. We need for unite go back to Africa and develop our own way of praising. But first we need to let go after them confusion. Them Bible, them religion, and that God. Boy, my brother, if 2020 don't give them the 2020 vision, then go blind forever.